It sure can. Gee, I hope we find the red herring, Mr. Strippy. Me too, Ollie boy. Right then, let's go fishing. Nice. So we go fishing. <clears throat> I'll see if I can find screenshots of it. Dude. Yeah, I think I might pick up the second game just for, like, this story. Imagine fishing minigame, right? It's like Guild Wars 2 all over again, guys. I can't escape it. I can't escape the fishing. I tried to escape the fishing by coming to a different game from Guild Wars 2. Still there. By the way, I heard the fishing was nerfed in Guild Wars 2. Is that true? Where am I going? Oh, there's a pond. Nice. Look, Ollie boy. See that red thing over there? No. Uh... I reckon we've found our fishy friend. You'd better go and take a closer look, though, just to make sure, ain't it? M me Why do I have to go over there? Well, who else is going to do it? Freddy the Fish Inspector? Yes. Definitely Freddy the Fish Inspector. Come on, just hop on them rickety-looking old... Uh, rickety-looking bits of wood, you'll, you'll do fine. Uh, gee, alright, I guess I'll try. Nice. Oh, uh, I guess we go this way now. Oh, there's the red thing. Nice. Ah! Ah! Nickers, he got away. I'm sorry. He's a lively one, alright. I think he went off towards the palace, Ellie boy, after him. After him, right. Night. Oh, are we going that way? Yeah, that's what I thought. The pools in Gaiala only spawn after the meta now, rather than all the time. Ah. Yo, this is just like Sav. Got jumping puzzles and everything. True. Although, the art style is better, in my opinion. Maybe that's a hot take. That was fun, I guess. Uh, where am I going? Over here? And I also don't have a cool cape. In Sap. But that's because my Guild Wars 2 fashion doesn't have a cape on it, so... Nice. So this is the king's favorite fish, huh? Tidy, that's a red herring if I ever saw one. True. In every sense of the word. Now we can get ourselves an audience with the king. Let's head back and see the palace guard, shall we? Shouldn't we put it in like a bowl or like a cup of water? Like, isn't it gonna die if we just like carry it over our head? <laughs> like, like a drippy. Somehow I feel like this isn't gonna be like good. Won't it be dead by the time we get to the palace or the king? We're like essentially suffocating it, aren't we? You again. I'm afraid we still haven't located King Tom's pet. This one, you mean? You came to deliver the king's fish back to him, sir. Is that... Goodness! I'd know the regal scarlet tones of the king's beloved red herring anywhere. Well, I'll be. I reckon you, uh, you've you swum out through the sewers into town, like. Is that so? I must let the other guards know right away. Ah, uh, if I remember rightly, you were... That's right, we need to see the king. Yes, of course, but with him in his current state... What's that? Something up? Is there? Uh, you can say that. Did I mention that the person charged with caring for the king's red herring just let it escape? Everyone in the palace has grown terribly lax of late. So lax that we need to enlist the help of passing travelers, as you know only too well. I probably shouldn't be telling you this, but the king himself has been, uh... Seems like it's been rubbing off on his subjects, okay? Like laziness? Yes. 
I'm afraid so, but perhaps being reunited with his beloved red herring will give him a boost he needs. In you go. Heidi, we're off to see the king. Come on, Ollie boy. Nice. We've got a fish, we've got the red herring, and now we go see Pleasure the king. You, you <laughs> yes. so it was I like you the king. Who delivered one's treasure back to one? Hmm? That's right. Yes, Yo, imagine and if you we gave him around. the fish and he just ate it right in front of us because, you know, he's a cat. Go on, man. Ask him. Come now, don't be shy. Well, your meow just see. Out with it now. We need your wand. We need your wand. That wasn't Wands part of the plan, wand. was it? Man. Huh? What did you say? Smell. Could it be? That's right, you will be out, He's not from our world. He's the one whose power freed me from my prison. What? You mean he broke his spell? This little boy? Yes. Do you understand what you're saying, Fairy? Once you that. defy him, there's no turning back. I know, I know, I know, but... But what precisely? Well, you know, he might be able to... It's not one's concern. You may not have the wand. Now be gone. Wow. Does that mean no wand, Mr. Droopy? Looks like it. So how do we get the wand now? Something wasn't quite right about our royal friend. Broken you might be able to take an ad break. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> uh, something wasn't quite right about our royal friend. Broken hearted he is, but... Or I'm broken headed. The king is? Ooh, we need to fix the king? Interesting. Lacking enthusiasm, it looked like. And because he's broken hearted... The whole kingdom's being dragged down with him. What are we waiting for? Let's go find the piece of heart he's missing. Blimey, you don't need much encouragement, do you? The guard outside of town was short on enthusiasm too, huh? Indeed he was, Ollie boy. Like I said, I reckon the king's broken heartedness is dragging everyone else down with him. But the other guard gave us some of his enthusiasm to help his friend. We should go ask him for some more. No, 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 man. Don't go doing that. That's a very important rule about barring pieces of people's hearts. Mm, there is. What is it? Well, you can't go taking the same piece of heart from the same person twice, see? One little scoop off the top is all it's safe to borrow. Well, I guess that makes sense, right? Gee, I didn't know that. I'll be sure to be real careful from now on. So, what do we do, Mr. Drippy? We thrall the town of a, of someone else with get up and go a plenty, ain't it? It's a sleepy old place, but there's bound to be someone somewhere. The only problem is where Ding Dong Dell's not exactly village sized, after all. We might even say it's proper massive. I guess it kind of is, huh? If something is, uh, da, 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 okay. Oh, hey, look, it's our little stone looking friend. Here comes the mechanic. Ooh. You seem perplexed, my young friends. I thought I might be, I might benefit from a dose of your expansive knowledge. My expansive knowledge. Thanks. That's real nice of you. You see, we need to borrow a piece of someone's heart, but we don't know how to find one. Oh, elementary, my dear Oliver. This time, uh, in times like these, just look at your locket. Huh? How do you mean? Well, not only can we carry pieces of the heart, the locket is also extremely sensitive to their proximity. It will glow when they are nearby. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. 
propriety so we can use it to track down some enthusiasm then, eh? Allow me to tell you a little bit more about the locket of yours. You will see that it has a habit of glowing brightly from time to time. This is how it reacts to the presence of those who possess one of the heart's virtues in abundance. Incidentally, those pieces of heart, spare, uh, heart to spare will also glow a uh, verdant green in the minimap in the top right of your screen. Neato. Neato. I'm going to start saying that from now on. I like that. It will start to tell you which of the virtues the subject has in, ex in excess, but it should still provide uh, exceedingly useful to you nonetheless. I just know it will.